Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Hyper here, and guys, all I'm gonna say is here it is, our very first episode of Clash of Clans. You guys have been wanting this for at least a couple weeks now, I'd say maybe even longer than that, and I've honestly been wanting to play this game as well myself, and I, I decided why not do it? If you guys want it, if I and I want it, if you guys want it and I want it, then I'm gonna go ahead and do it, so... Here it is, and I'm going to do this series like I did with Factions. If this video hits 7 likes, I'm going to continue the series. I'm setting a bit lower of a like goal purposefully, um, just because I know that probably uh, Clash of Clans won't get as much love as like OP Prison or Skyblock. But yeah, let's just get on straight into the video. Here is my base. I'm currently at Town Hall 7, and... Um, yeah, that's... I mean, that's pretty much it. I'm, I'm working on maxing out my base so far... All of my defenses are maxed, um, I'm pretty, yeah, all my defenses are maxed, except my Teslas, I believe, um, and my walls. Like, my wall, the only thing that I need to upgrade at this point are my walls and my traps, everything else completely maxed, and I actually used to have an old account, this account I started about, uh, uh six months ago, seven months ago, I used to have an old account, which I had been playing on for about a year, but, like, literally it was the most rushed account you guys had probably ever seen. It was literally like Town Hall 10 with like level 6. It, 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 was, it was bad, guys. Trust me. But here it is. Um, this base design has honestly been working the best for me. I have three base designs, two of which were original. and or Two of which were original, uh, one of which was um, copied from a website. This is working the best. If you guys want to copy it, here it is. Pretty simple. I mean, it's, it's only for a Town Hall 7. I'm sure a lot of you guys are probably like... Uh, to max town all tens or something, but I, I only started this account like six months ago. Give me some slack, guys. But what are we gonna be doing today? Well, first off, we're gonna be kind of showcasing. Um, well, not really showcasing. I just, just, I guess we should just say I'm gonna be kind of doing a couple attacks with these. This strategy right here, Lunian. Uh, very simple. But loons, trust me, they work extremely well. Um, but but like below 2k and above 4k like loons are kind of weird they work at really low levels and they also work at really high levels so uh, i don't know what's up with that but it is what it is but first off if i go into my defense log this guy actually i just want to kind of show you guys how this base how good this base really is this guy tried attacking me with hogs plus loons which that's it's kind of unheard of. I've honestly never seen that strategy before. But as you can see, he goes ahead, drops a hog to check my clan castle, which is on the outside of my base. That's honestly kind of like the only flaw with this base. Um, but he does drop off a bunch of hogs at the bottom, as well as hogs at the top. Now, those hogs will unfortunately take out my air defense. Uh, these hogs down here, he goes ahead and throws a heal spell on them. They take out my wizard tower, my second air defense, and my um archer tower so like hogs op I, I i don't know what that heal spell was D don't even ask guys i have no freaking clue what the heck that heal spell was I don't, I don't know if he just misclicked or something but he throws another heal spell down on those hogs which actually just ran out um and yeah so his loons are going in now an air bomb does go up on those two loons there but look at this guys so i actually have a shrink trap in the middle of my base and as you can see it shrinks all of those loons like, literally all of them, and that air bomb just comes up and just wrecks them all. Like, that Tesla was just one-shotting them left and right. And at this point, there's absolutely no hope for him, because either he doesn't have his king or it isn't healed, and, uh, that That's the attack, guys. That's it. 27 seconds, or, uh, 27%, and it's over for him. And, uh, yeah, so... That's just kind of showing you how well the base works. Now, granted, he did, he was, he wasn't using any cards that didn't attack buildings. So, literally, he would have to have destroyed... Every single one of my buildings just to uh, uh, get to my town hall and storages and all that. So, I mean, but but that's honestly not really my problem. That's kind of his fault, uh, if I'm going to be honest. But, uh, anyways, here's I'm going to be using 28 loons, 20 minions, as I said in the beginning. Loonion, very simple, but it works very, very well. Now, normally what I'll use with these is uh, either two rage and a heal, or a heal and two rage. Uh, I mean, that's the exact same thing. Either two rage and a heal, or two heals and a rage. Um, I kind, kind of, I don't know why. I just sometimes uh, two double rage works better. Sometimes a double heal works better. But let's just go ahead and see if we can find ourselves a good base to raid now. Uh, oh, 
Do we want to do this? This guy's actually... This guy's pretty rushed, I'm not gonna lie. And I honestly think... I think we would definitely be able to at least two-star this. Yeah, let's go for it. Screw it. I'm placing a minion down. Uh, and he does. He guess he doesn't have anything in his clan castle. Uh, at least not any flying troops or troops that can attack air. So, what do I want to do? I'm going to send in... I, gu I guess I'll send in, um... A loon? Do I want to do that? Yeah, I'll send in... I'll actually send in a couple loons right there. Uh, see if he has any traps. He doesn't, so I'm just going to spam my loons down. Now, that honestly probably was not the smartest move. But, hey, with loons, sometimes you got to take risks. Uh, sometimes it pays off, sometimes it doesn't. So, let me just get all of my minions down. My king's down. I probably should have placed him off at the top or something. But, it is what it is. I'll go ahead and place my last minion down to the right there. Now, which, which pair of loons should I rage? I'll go with these ones up at the top here. And also, I'll throw a heal spell down because this air bomb did just come up. Now, unfortunately, those loons didn't go for the air defense, but... They just took out the mortar like it was butter. I mean, honestly, they just absolutely wrecked everything in the center there. And now that the, the he has nothing left that can attack air. Like, literally nothing left that can attack air. So, my minions are just going to destroy that town hall. Like, literally, they're just going to absolutely wreck that town hall. His king just took out our king, which did get caught in a shrink trap unfortunately for us but we're gonna take out his king in response to that and this, this is gonna be a three star guys like straight up i can tell you guys right now this is gonna be a three star for sure like i, I don't know how this possibly couldn't be a three star like literally three two one yep three star there we go nice so that's how it works guys and it works especially well when they have all their air defenses like in the middle because you just rage the loons on them, and then they just destroy everything. Same thing with dragons, but loons work better. I, I, I'm honestly better at loons than I am with dragons. So, we can actually go ahead and upgrade a few walls, which, as I said at the beginning, walls and traps. That's what we need before maxing um, this base out to a max town all 7. Do we have anything in our treasury? Uh, oh, we actually almost have a full treasury. Nice. So, I guess, do I want to... Mm, I don't I don't want to withdraw that right now to be honest. I'm just gonna keep that in there for now I don't really see a reason to withdraw it uh, Right now. I'm gonna save that for maybe when I'm upgrading a storage or something Let's actually go ahead and oh oh shoot. I forgot. I still need to wait for my king Hold up. Let me quickly end this battle here. I completely forgot about my king Let me actually quickly wait for my king to heal Alrighty guys our king is now all the way back to his maximum health as you can see there i totally didn't spend gems because i was lazy um but let's just go ahead and get into another battle see if we can find another uh maybe like another rush town all seven like the first one that has just randomly has 200k gold uh that one doesn't look like a good base it doesn't have a lot of loot uh nor does this one i need normally when i'm attacking i try to look for at least like 150 or 125k of each uh, this one, yep, not a lot of loot, not a lot of loot either. Uh, this one, that's, I don't think we can, this, this one wasn't really a problem with the loot, that was just with the, uh, trap placement. Same thing here, he has freaking level 6, um, air defenses, and, uh, ooh, okay. Okay, guys, so, here's the base that I just found, uh, I don't think we'll be able to 3-star, but we'll definitely be able to at least 2-star. I mean, it, it has a thousand dark elixir. And 220k gold. How can you pass that up? I don't even know. Let's drop a minion. Guess he doesn't have anything in his clan castle. Let's go ahead and get a loon down to draw out any traps. Actually, the only place he could really have a trap is right by his uh, air sweeper. Because there isn't really many open spaces besides there. So I'm going to spam a bunch of my loons down. No, it didn't go, f oh, it didn't go for the air defense. Are you kidding me right now? Okay, well that sucks. But let's just go ahead and rage these up. Drop some minions in the back. I'll get my king down. Oh, oh crap. He has loons. I didn't, I complete. I didn't even think uh, about the fact that he might have like loons or something in his clan castle. That's going to suck. Let's go ahead and rage these loons up. Uh, hopefully, come on, king, survive. Dude, the king, it's running away. No way. Okay, he's off the screen right now. I'm kind of paying attention more to these loons here because I don't want them to get wrecked. Okay, yep, there's, a, there's another air bomb. I'm going to heal them up. And no way did our king actually survive. Look at that, guys. Look how small, look how little health he has left. That is actually amazing, guys. That was, that was like t 10 out of 10 luck right there. Our loons are going to die. And we have some minions. 
are the are these guys gonna be enough for the town hall though? Let me just okay. So uh no, or, I don't think they're gonna be able to do it, guys. There's only three left. Um and wait, no way. Are you kidding me right now? That is actually the best luck right there. Like, literally, it's out of range of all three of those. Nice, dude. So we're going to get the Town Hall, which is going to be a two-star, obviously. And we're going to get uh, a little bit of damage on this gold storage right here, most likely. So, yep, unfortunately, now they are in range, so they're all going to get wrecked by the Archer Tower. But honestly, at this point, we just got to wait for these minions to do their thing. And uh, then that's going to pretty much be the battle right there. Def as I said, not a three star, but uh, I mean, a two star is pretty good. So let's just wait for these minions to die here. Uh, wait, seriously, again? So you're, dude, this guy has the worst luck right now. Like literally first my king, which was at 0.9 health or whatever, 0.1 hearts, uh, or point, I, I don't, I don't even know, man. Like, literally, those were three lucky plays in a row with the minions and the king. But, yo, we just got all of the Dark Elixir as well as uh, about 125,000 gold. That's what I'm talking about. And let's, we can actually go ahead and upgrade some more walls. Nice. So, I think, I, I think that's pretty much it, guys. I mean, I just kind of wanted to show you guys how overpowered that was. We were, we were able to get about 800,000 gold because we were able to upgrade four walls. So, or wait, no, I think we had like 300k at the beginning maybe. I don't really know, but still. That was some really good plays. We have 6,000 Dark Elixir, and honestly, I almost forgot. We actually have a level 4 king right now, so that means uh, once we get him, we, we're only one level away from unlocking the Iron Fist ability, so... I'm really excited for that. I didn't even think about that at the beginning. That's also one other thing we need before upgrading the Town Hall Late. I want to have at least a level 5 king, which we need about 20,000 Dark Elixir for. And it, it's a good thing we that we got about 1,000 from that one raid. But anyways, guys, that's going to do it for today's episode of Clash of Clans. As I said in the beginning, 7 likes, and I will do a full-time series on this. Also, if you're new to the channel... Hit that subscribe button. Hashtag road to 1k, guys. Get it trending. Um, and anyways, I guess I will see you guys in the next one.